hello everyone welcome to the another course in laravel so today in this series we are going to create a cms system you can say that it would be a content management system or blog system where there would be a, an administrator which will publish the post from the admin side and this post will be automatically visible on the website right so an administrator will also create some categories and uh, some uh, tags and these tags will be um, will belongs to a specific post so basically we are going to create a blog system where there would be categories post and their tags and recent post and stuff like that so how to create them in the real environment because i most of the time i prefer to shoot the series in the real environment because people learn a lot from the real environment because if I did any of the mistake so they can also learn that what's the mistake and how to overcome this uh, problem right so here I came with two uh, types of theme the first one is for the administrator so this one is a purple dashboard theme so basically we are going to use this for the administrator and then this uh, theme will be linked with this website and when we are going to publish something from the admin side so this will be visible on this uh, blog section so basically we are going to use this blog on the home home page so basically we are going to display the blog right side sidebar like this so we have multiple blogs and there would be our latest uh, blogs their categories their tags and uh, stuff like that so user can also click on the blog and uh, uh, view its complete information with large image and with details right so it's a fully um, full blog system where administrator will uh, publish or draft the post and then these posts will be visible on the uh, on the website right so now question comes that uh, is these themes how we can get these themes so basically you can uh, i came with these both themes so this one is also free so you can instantly click on this download and get this theme so let me open the notepad so whenever i'm going to render my videos so i'm going to add this in the description so you can easily get this theme by clicking on this and click on this download button front end theme and then back end Theme. so this backend theme is available here on this bootstrap dot dash and you can get this this would name this uh, purple dashboard right so here okay so I uh, uh, downloaded them and extracted this file and I'm opening this admin dashboard in my local and this one is also in my local right so we are going to do this with the scratch how we can integrate the admin dashboard into the into our laravel application how to integrate this website how to manage their resources how to manage their images and stuff like that right so let me check the video size no it's not going bigger so by the way if you are uh, not familiar with my youtube channel so my uh, my name is dayat niazi and uh, i'm full stack web developer shooting different playlist on the laravel so I have created many playlists on the Laravel so you can if you are uh, if you are interested to learn about the Laravel so these series will help you a lot because uh, in my all series I tried to shoot them from zero to hero so you can learn anything uh, you can't uh, miss anything when you are learning this right so let me go to the playlist okay okay man just open this okay so here i have a xamp for windows deploy laravel apps on the server so how you can deploy them on the real production server bootstrap dashboard with the wheat so wheat is a new asset bundler which came in laravel 9.18 so you can also wheat with laravel wheat with vue.js wheat with react.js and stuff like that laravel design pattern if you are building a very complex application so you can follow my this laravel design pattern series where i completely explain that how to manage the manage your project when you have a large application so jquery with ajax call so if you want to create something without the page refresh so you can watch this code so set up vs code for laravel so if you are a laravel developer so you uh, must watch this series because here i explain everything that uh, 
uh, how to add the namespace at the top uh, by clicking on it how to instantly go uh, into the any of the files how to do different uh, things like how to add uh, uh, some code on the top and Laravel PD and much more things so you don't need to skip this out so Laravel PDF series where I completely explain that how you can generate the different PDF Laravel 9 full course where you can get the get the course and then after this uh, co completion of course you will get uh, the full project overview that how you can create a project from hero to hero okay so integrate admin dashboard advanced series and much more things so don't forget to check them out and also subscribe the channel to get the regular tips and tricks from my youtube channel so this is then 13 like 13 and 15 and stuff like that so i'm posting daily uh, tips and tricks uh, about videos and uh, and in the comment uh, in the post form so hope you will love this channel and you will get some beneficial okay so download these themes and in the next video i'm going to create a full project and in the project i'm going to uh, i'm going to add these two themes so i will meet you in the next one bye bye